In this video, let's take a look at the speed improvements for rendering hair inside of V-Ray 3.0. If we look at our V-Ray frame buffer history, we'll see that this scene took 4 minutes and 40 seconds at half HD resolution in V-Ray 2.4. Now let's see how fast it'll render in 3.0. Our demo scene is set up using Ornatrix hair with millions of strands, and we've added a V-Ray area light behind our model to demonstrate the backscattering effect. We're also using brute force for our primary GI and light cache for the secondary. In V-Ray 3.0, not only have we optimized the core ray tracing calculations, but the V-Ray hair material shader has been optimized as well. I'll go ahead and pause the recording while the scene finishes rendering. Okay, so now let's see how fast it rendered in V-Ray 3.0. So in our previous version, it was 4 minutes and 40 seconds, and we've cut that down now to 2 minutes and 35 seconds. Well, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more V-Ray 3.0 videos.